today is Tuesday so I mentioned in the last video the new car video that um, we are trying to get rid of the SUV we're trying to sell it uh, because you know we just we've put a lot of uh, money into it and it's not a ga it's not gas efficient and we need a gas efficient car for Cesar to take to work um so we actually the clutch went out on it so we are taking it to get fixed tomorrow i think tomorrow um and Cesar has already got some inquiries inquiries correct me if i'm wrong or don't correct me if i'm wrong i had somebody leave me like a crappy comment on one of my videos <laughs> um but he's got some inquiries about it um and people asking him if he can send more pictures so i'm actually going to go out there right now and clean up the subaru and take some pictures of it so that says i can send them to potential buyers um so yeah that's what we're gonna do um but yeah we're gonna do that and then after the car is all clean and the clothes is all dry we are gonna head over to the grocery store <clears throat> And pick up some stuff because i want to start cooking better again i've kind of been going through i don't know what and i've all i've been wanting to do was eat bad things so i want to go ahead and start my good eating again like i was doing for a very long time um and yeah also i went back to sally's even though i said i wouldn't and i took back my um that nail polish i had bought because when I got home, I realized that I already had one that was that color, but it was just regular. It wasn't gel. Um, so I took it back and I got this one. This is a white gel nail polish. It's called Arctic Freeze. And it just, it looks so pretty. So um, we are making sure the Subi shines and looks good because we're taking photos of it so that we can possibly sell it. Um, we've had some people inquire about it, so hopefully... Um, but we actually just called the tow truck right now and they're gonna take it to the dealership so it can get um, the parts replaced that it needs um, so hopefully they'll be here soon uh, but here is the Subi we're gonna miss this little bad boy baby on board Yep, so here it is. <laughs> Harmony, come here, come here, come here. No, 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 no. Wah, wah, wah. Right there. Like nothing. Perfect. The same guy that dropped off, dropped his car off last year. Like, yeah, I think so. You know, you know what I mean. So today is Wednesday. Um, so it's the next day from when we went to drop off the Subi, which was yesterday. Um, but today we went to the mall um, because I was looking for some sandals for Harmony. Um, and I found some and they match my sandals. Um, but most of you probably think they're so ugly. Right now, um, I am actually waiting for Sessa to come home because we're gonna go pick up the Subaru from the dealership. Um, it is fixed and everything. She's dressed all crazy because we're literally just going to run over there. Um, but I got her those little brown Birkenstock looking sandals from Old Navy. They look just like mine. Also, if you hate poop talk, just uh, fast forward. But yesterday, my worst freaking nightmare came true. Um, Harmony woke up from her nap and she was all like happy. And then she just started screaming. And I looked down at her. She's poop on her hands, poop on her clothes. Her diaper is off and she's stepping in her poop diaper. Yeah, that was a nightmare. Oh, and Sessa's here. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Ready? Oh, her shoes are cute. They're cute, huh? They look like mine. <laughs> you guys, I apologize if I look a little bit crazy, but I was actually going through my emails right now. Um, and I received an email from a brand um, who they are like a cosmetics consultation platform to where if you want to get plastic surgery or if you've gotten plastic surgery um i guess you can go on there and like ask questions get some answers before you go to like an actual doctor maybe the reason why they contacted me and asked me if i wanted to um share about my experience is because i have a video that video was called i got cheekbone implants with a question mark 
and I in fact did not get cheekbone implants I don't have any plastic surgery the reason why that video was called that is because I got three two two root canals done in one day and my entire face was swollen so it literally felt like my cheeks were like like this so I, I was moving my mouth but my cheeks felt like this so it looked like I had cheekbone implants so I'm gonna contact the company and tell them you know tell them the story or you know just respectfully decline um, because they they you know they're willing to do like a brand deal with me if I share my experience which I've never had an experience because I don't have cheekbone implants um, and then I never went to the grocery store I told you guys so many times that I was gonna go to the grocery store in this video but we never went also oh my gosh I forgot to tell you guys there is a show that I got really into last weekend. It's on Netflix. It's called Greenleaf. Um, it's on the Oprah Winfrey Network, and it is so, so good. Oh, my goodness. They have season one, which is 13 episodes, um, and then yesterday, season two premiered. But I wasn't able to get a stream, so I wasn't able to watch it. Also, I realized that I've got a ton of stretch marks here. Uh, and a ton of stretch marks all over my arms and you may notice that my arms are a little flabby and that's okay because believe it or not I used to weigh over 200 pounds um, that is a thing an experience that I don't think I've ever shared on YouTube with you guys um, but I used to weigh over 200 pounds so I lost about 90 pounds or so um so yeah that is why i have a ton of stretch marks and honestly i'm not ashamed of them they are my battle scars i've been through a lot i used to be really 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 heavy um and anybody that knows me from high school and stuff knows that i was the ugly duckling i was yeah i mm. I've been through a lot, so yeah, just wanted to point out my stretch marks. I know that they're there, so if you noticed them in the recent videos and we're like, what the heck, you know. So, uh, I came to Target, like, to get some, like, run some errands and stuff, and I, Harmony fell asleep in her stroller, and Target is across the parking lot from Bank of America, and I didn't want to put her in the car and then take her out and then put her in to grow out, so I just walked over here, um... But it was like very treacherous and sunny, so I'm taking a break because the sun like is frying me up. Um, and I think now I'm just gonna go to Whole Foods and see what they've got. And then from there, we gotta finish running our errands. So uh, yeah. Harmony and me are already ready. We are about to leave the house. I'm just warming up the car because I have an appointment at Lens Crafters today because I am finally, hopefully, going to get rid of my glasses and I'm going to hopefully get contacts, um, which I know that I won't get them today because I feel, I believe they have to like order them or something. Um, but I am so over my glasses. I have suffered for a year with my glasses. They're so heavy. And when I'm not wearing them, they cause this little red dot right here. Um, so I'm so ready, so ready to be over done with these glasses. They are so heavy for my face. But since I don't have like a bridge, I needed to get the ones with these little nose pads. Um, but yeah, I'm miserable with glasses. Um, so I... Oh, hey! Uh, she took off her sandals! Um, so I almost left the house without my wing liner on this eye. So I did this eye and then I almost left without doing this eye. Um, but yeah, my mom's gonna watch Harmony while I get um, go to the eye doctor because our store is right above Lens Crafters at the mall. So, works out. that I'm in the car again um, but I got my contacts and these are actually trial contacts um, 
so I'm supposed to try them out for about six to ten days to see if I like them and to see if the prescriptions okay um, before I actually order them so it turns out I have a like a stigmatism in my left eye which is weird because I feel like I strain my right eye more um, so I have to wear two different types of contacts one to treat the stigmatism and the regular one um, so it, it's kind of weird because it feels like like I have like like a booger in my eye or something it's so weird um, but this car like backed in so close to my car um, but anyway hopefully Harmony will take a nap right now and we'll stop at Starbucks again of course um, and yeah then maybe I'll eat something because I'm really hungry 